we are going to see how to open a gdb file that we downloaded from a web resource like open government data how to view it in qgis that's the purpose of this video for example if you go to the ontario geo hub you can look at the agricultural resource inventory and if you click on open document it opens a arcgis page where the open actually downloads a gdb file for you so if you click on the open here here it downloads a gdb file so when you go to qgis it's a zip file so you can extract the gdb and put it in a preferred directory and go to c drive uh, where, wherever you have loaded it and i'm going to show you this particular one agriculture resource inventory so we are going to explore this agree complete gdb so all you need to do is move this from here to the layers and it automatically loads it for you so accept the warning there and it's loading now So I'm interested in the Ottawa region. So here is the Ottawa region. So I'm going to zoom to it. So my region of interest is somewhere here near the blue bog. I can also change the style. So if I click on style, I can, for example, change the color of it. I can close this. And here it is. I can zoom further in. Yeah, so here is where my farm is. So to be sure that this is the right location, I can now add the uh, Google Earth. So why do we have that? It's in the XYZ tiles. Yeah, so I'm going to load the Google Earth. So I'm going to say OK because it's going to change the projection a little bit to the projection of the shape file. So here is Google Earth. So this makes it easy for me to identify my Green Creek. So if I would like a KMZ file to be added to it, so we have seen this already. Let me demonstrate again. So I can load a KMZ file that I had drawn earlier. So here it is. So this is where my farm was. So if you explore this information, if you're in the Agri resource inventory, click on the pink polygon you see it's describing it as rough land whereas the fields below are correctly described as field and fence crow because of the shape probably the algorithm used the shape there so this is what i meant by uh, classification done by unsupervised classification method in auto imagery ended up placing it as a rough land when I zoom in, I can see my farm and the path from the parking lot here. Yeah. So this is now filled. If I like to change this to a simpler version, 
I can actually say I want only the border or some design on it. Yeah, then you can see through the farm or you can just say outline. Yeah. So you can look inside. Yeah. Okay, I think you know how to change uh, symbols. So here we have added uh, an imagery, satellite imagery, a KMZ file and GDB together. So you can view multiple files together in QGIS. All of these files were derived from outside resources. 